This is the energy vibration lesson for the Ophiosis Sun Moon and Rising. Um, and I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for supporting my channel. Please, please, please um, find out from people, um, share these videos. And this video is going to take an hour. Welcome if you're a newcomer. Please subscribe, subscribe. Please leave a message on these videos. This is the year video for the year 2019. I'm seeing that more um, of you guys are finding out who you are. Please stay with um, this um, channel and um, this energy vibration because a lot of you are going to be needing it in the year 2019 because this is a year where you're going to be realizing your gifts coming out and you're going to be really, really blown from the chart off and um, you know it's good to do a year reading because we can see what is happening this is the year of change in the guards a lot of stuff is going to be happening so you obsolete people be ready because if you notice you um, begin the year with the energy of the devil and the moon and these are fire water and water because your spirit guides are coming in in the month of uh, uh, March now you guys might see this to be um, not what you're looking for but it's about you accepting that you are the most um, special person on this planet because you're a healer you can take life and you can give life you um, guys so if you were born November 29th until December 17 you need to get in alignment with who you are and that is what this year 2019 is all about because it's going to teach you to go back and find what is your divine life purpose okay so you obsolete people I love you guys I love you guys so much please like share these videos and we are going to be looking at the energies of what is happening for you guys for the rest of the year the quarter readings are hot go and check out the quarter readings you have the devil and you have the moon especially the people who are who are born on um, five um, four six six um, six p.m. till 5 p.m. in the morning um, this is going to affect you in this year okay so let's see what else is coming up for um, the obsolete people in the year 2019 you have a very 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 lucky card coming up with a star so a lot of good things are going to be coming in for uh, you obsolete people I'm seeing a lot of air energies that is going to be coming in and helping you energy of the Sun is here which is very powerful in the month of August but then we have the tower energy that is coming up in September and we have the world that is here in November we have transition in um, uh, the, the, the year the world that is coming up in um, October and then we have transition and the wheel of fortune oh my god so wonderful wonderful energies that is coming in because um, and we have to ask for a bonus card it's just being you being you and they're saying not change the energies it's just being you who you are okay so um we're going to just take that out and then we know it's just about being you but we still have to ask for another energy and it's going to be um the star um that is here for you guys amen then we have um, the magician because that's why the magician comes in to align you guys with your right purpose in life then we have the tower oh the tower energy is coming in in September if you guys noticed last year there was absolutely no ten tower energy the world is coming in that transition for you guys transition for you guys and you have the wheel of fortune okay but we still have to and they're giving you the lovers okay so we have to ask what is the bonus energy that's coming in for these guys the fountain is here bringing luck with an energy of a new start so oh my god and I was thinking about doing that oh my god okay so let's go back and see what is happening so you guys again have the energy of seven 
how many people have the energy of the Gemini have the energy of the seven Taurus have the energy of the seven and you guys have the energy of the seven the number you should hold in mind this year is 151 okay 151 one and five that is the energy of the devil but um, uh, one plus five plus one is seven so it's a year of uh, going out and you start so we had energy of the fountain so the luckiest month for you guys is going to be the month of April is the luckiest month for you guys so we have the energy of uh, um, the chariot so you guys have the energy of the chariot so you guys whatever there's transmission transmission that is going to be happening which what is going to be transpiring and what is going to be taking place is that you're going to overcome a situation and become the star you're going to be overcoming a situation and you're going to become in the star you're going to be understanding that you are the star that you are or the ones who came in with those powerful energies to help and heal people but yet still you can make things happen for yourself and this is going to be good so um, let's get a message before and let's get a, a picture before um, we move on um, remember your luckiest month is going to be in the month of April that's going to be your luckiest month okay so let's get back to your reading okay so um, the quartal, the first quartal reading is up, and whatever the situation is, the first quartal reading is already up. But there, these are extra message that is coming out. This video is going to take an hour or more, so thirty minutes will be on YouTube, and the rest is going to be on demand. And it's just a dollar ninety nine, a dollar ninety nine. That's it, because this reading is so long; it takes a long time to get them in the YouTube. And we are going to have extra information coming up for you you guys especially this year because this year you're going to find out who you truly really are you're going to find out what you have to give this world and it's going to be very surprising now there is a situation that is coming up in January and this and remember this is the reading for the people who were born November 29 until December 17 the, the go and listen to the general energies because it's going to have a lot of information for you guys okay so let's look and see why it's happening in the month of January general energies is the energy of uh, judgment so a judgment call is going to be coming in people are going to be using their ego base it could be worldwide but it could be affecting um, you um, uh, you people more okay so be aware of that this judgment call so go back and listen um, to the energy read and to see what was happening um, because in the month of January things are going to be taking place month of February the eye princess comes up so this is about secrets what is going to be happening eye princess and the moon um, brace yourself especially um, brace yourself because some information is going to be coming out this is going to be affecting worldwide because you guys are going to be um, giving this information um, you're going to be inform informing um, other people about something so you guys someone between the ages or some people between the ages of 29 November and 17 December is going to be giving the world some information about something they weren't aware of that you found out okay so this is um, this is good for you guys month of March the energy is a wheel of fortune and the hermit is here the hermit is going to be showing you your divine purpose the hermit is coming in to show you your divine purpose and you're going to be making a lot of money with this okay remember for to know exactly what is going to be happening you have to check us out with a general reading now this is the luckiest one for Yuli you have the infinity sign coming in um, and this infinity sign is the sign of your spirit guides and universal beams that is coming down to help you guys because you guys are very special you guys are from different solar planets and different star seeds um, and they're going to be coming down and they're letting you know that in the month of uh, um, in the month of April they're going to be coming out and being and showing up themselves and communicating via the dream times especially for the people who were born um, after 6 p.m. and 5 a.m. in the morning you're going to be feeling this energy a lot okay via the psychic dream and that sort of a thing in April so April is going to be a very surprising month 
for you guys it's gonna give you a new start but it's that but this new start is letting you know that you're different from the rest of us okay now we are going to be looking at the month of May May is the energy of justice but you have the energy of the star May is the energy of justice it's in a strength because in this deck in a strength is the 11 and May is going to you're going to become the star you're going to be showing up for yourself you're going to be accepting who you are as, as a divine individual okay June that is water so we had um, hair um, hair and water so it's gonna be a powerful quarter the second quarter in the month of June and then the first six months of this year what we have we have an earth energy and you have the energy of the Angman. so you're coming down and you're resting you're realizing who you are you're realizing the secrets that was kept from you since you were born and you're understanding that you weren't wrong about what you were feeling about yourself and what you thought about society so this is going to be good because it's going to be taking you to a place where you're feeling the inner power of who you are so this is going to be good as we move forward and we are looking at the energy of um, July July is the beginning of the second half year and we have the energy of the Sun and you have the energy of the magician now ladies and gentlemen you are going to be sparkling because you are going to be understanding who you are you're going to be understanding your gifts you're going to be understanding why you have felt certain ways at certain time of your life and you're going to be understanding and moving yourself forward in a very very positive direction because you're going to be releasing yourself from certain situations and energy and you're going to be understanding what has been transpiring so this is good whatever is happening and it's going to be good in the uh, second half year as we look at the month of August August general energy is the energy of the star you have the energy of the, of the Sun this is a, a very powerful month so um, May, uh, April and um, April and August is going to just be powerful it's going to propel you and with this um, surge of energy that is coming in it's going to be pushing you forward to be who you are you were meant to be and this is going to be good jobs business surprise if you have been waiting for a long time to find the right places the right people the right business it's gonna be just so poor and so powerful now September change of guard with September September ah. September the energy of uh, um, the star is the general energy but something is leaving your life unexpectedly something is just going to be leaving your life unexpectedly something is going to be leaving your life and whatever this thing is that is unexpectedly leaving your life needs to leave your life and you're going to be feeling much better ending the year as we look at the month of October the tower is here and a new start and a new beginning is coming out for you so in the month of October a new start a new beginning because something has been removed from your life the tower energy um, is here in the month of September and in October in general energy the tower is here but yet still you're left leaving something behind and you're moving forward and this is going to be extremely powerful as we look at your central your um, uh, your peak um, the crowning of your reading you have the energy of transformation transformation is coming in now not a lot of people have the energy of transformation except the Libras have it as their overall energies but you have transformation as the as the peak um, in your um, year so um, whatever is happening is that you're going to be um, the energy of the snake that is um, changing skin and in the month of November you are going to be feeling your true divine self coming in and this is going to be so propelled in you to do the right thing and uh, to choose the right career and that sort of a thing and you're going to be understanding this from a higher perspective okay because most of you vibrate on a night dimension only when you are vibrating lower than you um, return to the three dimension December powerful December the energy of the moon and especially for the people who were born after 6 p.m. to 5 a.m. in the morning this year is going to be propelling you this is the wheel of fortune bringing you a lot of luck a lot of luck and the overall energy of the year is 
um, victory and success so it's a transformation and transformation in a powerful way because it's bringing you out uh, releasing you of that which no longer serve you and bringing you some wonderful positive uh, abundance in your life and this is just going to be powerful so here we are ladies and gentlemen this is a powerful year for you guys also Sagittarius has it but you guys have it and Sagittarians are working with double energies so if you're a Sagittarius that is watching this this is good because you're going to be receiving the energy from Sagittarius but also the energy from the Ophiosis mentioned so this is just going to be powerful and this is going to be wonderful because what is aligning um, this year for you guys is that you're finding you're who you are as a true spiritual being you're moving um, so powerful and understanding who you are and accepting who you are and this is going to be good as we look at January January something is going to be released out of your life because information is going to be coming out some of you could be um, let in um, humanity knows something or some of you could be leaving something behind some um, lower energies and deceptive things um, as we look at February we have the energy of the moon this is going to be affecting a lot of people I'm seeing in the month of February and August February the energy of the people who are born uh, 6 p.m. till 5 p.m. that is going to be um, affecting you in the month of August the people who are born um, uh, um, um, 12 um, um, in the night until uh, 6 uh, 6 p.m. in the evening you are going to be feeling that energy of uh, what is transpiring um, for you guys in this year lucky months may uh, lucky months may uh, August July August um, um, December and October those are your lucky months these are powerful um, energies that are coming in um, remember that this reading is going to take um, a, 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 a hour because it's the year reading for the extended version of this reading to understand what is going to be happening because this is a general reading please order your personalized reading please please order your personalized reading because this is going to be wonderful this is going to be fantastic because by ordering your personalized reading what is happening and what is transpiring is that you are going to be showing um, positive energies um, towards yourself and towards all this okay so let's see because um, we're working with the animal spirit guides and we're going to be looking to see what animal spirit guys is going to be um, helping you guys out in the first six months what animal spirit guide is going to be helping you guys out in the first one the oyster the oyster and this is so powerful because this is what I'm saying to you guys the energy of the oyster is someone who has a hard shell on but within inside it is so um, such a wonderful person but um, this oyster has so much wisdom and knowledge and can heal the world and this is what is going to be happening for you guys in the first six months of the year so the people who were born in the first six months of the year who were born um, after 6 p.m. to 6 p.m. this is going to be affecting you um, you're going to be having the energy of the oyster because you're going to be seeing who you truly are under under this hurtly figure that we have you're going to be realizing that you are a star beam and you have known it your entire life but now it's as if you're putting your finger on it and you're realizing who you are that you're not of this planet because um, you're not vibrating you're always vibrating higher than the people on this planet okay so let's look and let's see what else is coming out Wow now and uh, this is this again this is another sign for you guys to let you know how special you are this is one of the most special the sea serpents this is one of the most special 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 this is like in the back and I'm going to be reading for the sea serpents so I have to read for the oysters also to let you guys know who you are because this is all about we are using the energy of the water and the sea serpent is also the energy of the water um, but the oysters you guys are the most beautiful because you have the pearl okay and you know I can't express this anymore how um, you guys are 
the most gifted on this planet because you hold a pearl an oyster hold a pearl okay the energy for the oyster for the first six months of the year patient secrets keeper of hidden in a uh, of hidden in a treasure okay so again patient secret keeper hidden in a treasure and that is your good because you guys represent the energy of the pearls of this planet so let no one tell you anything if you were born November 29 yeah if you were born November 29 until December 17 you are the pearl of this planet okay focus in the mount of the oyster is unmatched anything an oyster personality puts their mind to their own achievement with grace and charm the only problem is the oysters type often take their inner gifts from granted for granted they become shy or doubtful and this can lead to withdrawing and or protecting their deepest desire in life's work when the oyster card appears it's important to reveal your inner treasures what is it that you have been hesitating to share the world is waiting to see okay I can't say anything else can't say anything else it says it all I will never add another another sentence to this okay when being balanced feeling blessed and generous and the masterful so you're the masters of this universe masters of this planet okay when not you're being reluctant grip of fear and cry pop to share something is when you share information you guys are just so powerful okay the sea serpent healing emotional wounds expressing desire and this is from July until December the sea serpent represent the energies of expression whether it's emotional creative sensitivity or the desire of the sea serpent help us to move and direct our energy into a healthy current when the ascension of this card is being balanced we express ourselves creatively and sexually without the fear of shame we know that we deserve most of it our hearts are at the ease of our relationship and are meaningful and ending the we lose the grip of self-judgment and we let the cold water of forgiveness in to the eat of the wounds when the energy of the sea serpent is not yet activated our emotional and creativity are left in the mud muddy water current of the expression stargates in some here of our lives and in other time and places in the flood it's important to remember no matter what the water of our emotion lives lightly looks like the sea serpent love us just the same like a mother she wraps herself around her little babies I love you guys powerful so some of you are going to be taking on the, the energy of the oyster and some of you are going to be taking on the energy of the sea serpent I'm gonna say goodbye I'm not even adding another word I'm gonna be saying goodbye to um, the people on YouTube and the people who wants to see the extended of this reader the people who wants to see the extended